everybody, it's Lisa and today I'm going to be talking about Frostblood by Ellie Blake. Frostblood is about a 17 year old girl called Ruby who is a fireblood. She has to hide who she is from the kind of ruling ice class. There's ice bloods that can basically shoot ice and do basically ice benders and fire bloods who are basically firebenders. Yes, I'm going to call them that now. They are the firebenders and frostbenders. Yeah, yeah, like that. Ruby is hunted because of what she is and when the King's Frostbloods kill her mother early on in the book she then joins with certain Frostbloods in a campaign to kill the King. So this book came to me because I'm doing some work with Hodder in February this year so um, one of the publicists just emailed me the net galley key for this book and I had heard nothing about this book but I'm so happy she emailed me the key because mm, this book was beautifully written, I loved it. Straight up, I'll say there was a cliche I saw coming a mile away. I saw that cliche coming from a mile away, but I wanted that cliche to happen. I wanted this cliche to happen, so I'm glad it did. Cause y'all know me, I'm the kind of girl that likes a certain amount of cliche in her story. This book is more of what we see in most books nowadays. It is two species of people conflicting with each other, one of them is daily stamped out, and the thing is, these books can very easily be stagnant, and this book wasn't. I enjoyed reading it, I read it all in a day, and I was actually in a bit of a reading slump when I first read this book. The characters I loved, they're believable, they are, you feel for them. There is a romance plot in this book, but it is not all-encompassing and overwhelming. It's the perfect amount. Arcus, which is the guy's name, is a character in his own right which I loved. I loved him as a character. He had a lot of hidden depth. He had flaws. He had fears. He wasn't some oh super brave man who's gonna rescue everyone. He had legitimate flaws and legitimate fears and I love it when a character's like that. I love it. This book comes out on the 10th of January so depending on how lazy I have been with editing and uploading this video this book may be coming out really soon or it may already be out because you know I like to procrastinate when it comes to editing my videos. Overall guys I would say that Frostblood is well worth a read. It is for fans of Queen of the Tearling, it is for fans of I don't know what, what else? What else would you like if you like this? I think Queen of the Tearling, I think Reign of Shadows, I think... What else am I thinking? I don't know, it's like, it's like there's emptiness in my brain because thoughts don't happen in my brain. My brain is filled with words from all the books that I read. Okay, so I totally lost my train of thought there, but this book was good. That's all I will say guys, it is good. If you like the sound of it, I will leave the Goodreads link down below so you can do your own research and come to your own conclusion. After I read this book, I tweeted out that I wanted to cuddle with a piece of snow and the author replied and ever since then I have wanted snow. Because I am a cold person, I would definitely be a frost blood. I am not the kind of person that wants warmth, I always want the cold. The only time that I feel like I need to be warm is when I'm ill. And like seriously I've got the flu, I need to snuggle up in a million warm blankets ill. But most of the time I love the cold, I love it and I hate the heat. Um, my mother-in-law constantly puts the heating on in this house and I want to kill her because the heating she turns this house into an inferno this house is a fire blood stream my ice bloods nightmare so I am a proud ice blood go read this book guys this book was so good that I will buy a physical copy when it comes out because I like having a physical book if I've read the ER if that makes sense anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video like comment and subscribe and click over there to see two of my latest videos Go on. You know you want to click them. I don't know, but I put videos on there for you to watch, so you know why stop watching? Hope you guys enjoyed. 